So Miss Alexis, how exactly does the calcium cycle work? Well, in simple terms, calcium is used to make bones, shells, and coral skeletons. But we'll go more in depth on the calcium cycle. So Miss Alexis, how exactly does the calcium cycle begin? Well, there is two steps. Weathering is the process of breaking down rocks and minerals on the Earth's surface, while erosion is where the rocks and minerals get swept into the ocean. There's the ocean, guys. There's the ocean, guys. So what's next, Miss Alexis? Well, calcium hydrogen carbonate is dissolved and then is taken into the ocean. <laughs> then calcium ions are present on the surface of the ocean. This is why many marine organisms take this chemical in through a process called... Mr. Well, can you explain to me the rest of the calcium cycle? Well, at first, marine organisms begin to die and sink to the bottom of the ocean where they are eaten by predators. It's a life cycle process, which is now what I talk about coral reefs. Coral reefs use calcium carbonate as a building block structure. This is what made the exoskeleton of the corals. It provides food, shelter, and any other needs for other organisms to float around the sea. Go. This is what made the escos esco oh. <laughs> All right. This is what made the esco oh. exo. So Mr. Will, can you explain to me the rest of the calcium cycle, please? Well, marine organisms begin to die and sink to the bottom of the ocean to where it end up getting... <laughs> <laughs> Coral reefs use calcium carbonate. <laughs> I forgot. Now, rocks. They're jumping. <laughs> rocks and minerals on the Earth's surface. Don't throw the rock. We need it. Rock we got. I know. Don't throw it. Oh my God. I'm still recording. <laughs> This is why many marine organisms take this process in through a corona? I'm Question mark. <laughs>